Nervous when I played with Luna in the new team in the new roster because we are like know to each other, we know how we play, and then coming to a different team as a known bot lane, like we know how to play, and um, like uh, but we don't know how the others will play. Uh, yeah, I mean so, I'm always excited to play on LAN and like offline tournaments to see all the people coming there to see uh, also enemy team and like my teammates of course, um, and it's always fun playing on stage. I love it so much, so I was really excited to come in here. Yeah. Yeah, so today is uh, Salzburg Level Up. So we are here with SK Rosa at, the, um, at Salzburg right now. We're chilling at the hotel. And as you probably have seen already, um, we are not here with Wolfie. So right now we will have to play with me at the event in the show match against NN Ovo. I feel really relaxed to be playing today um, because I just want to have like, the best experience today. It's a really nice um, chance we are having today to play. We are here to watch the LEC. So right now we are going to Expo. Legit, we have this microphone so Ayush can hear everything we're saying right now. Which color, Ayush? Random or more like the color? Go for blue. This oh one? my lord. No. <laughs> no. That won't matter. Huh? I'm sorry, that won't matter. Okay. What about I purple? imagine I ask you and then I say no. Apo, can I ask you a question? Yeah. How are you feeling? Chilling. Do you have any last words? No. Apo is very fun to interview because she says yes, no. The atmosphere is also insane. It's so nice that the people um, and the cosplayer also are around um, and you can chill out with everyone. That's I'm having a lot of fun with Mo. <laughs> the impact of Everosa I see is that we are part of like big, big events, big, a big part of, of being SK. Oh my god, I have like so many so many fond memories of SK Barosa, like doing all the ECs, they always were there. We always like visited them during the boot camps and we're doing like the EC in production. So over the years I think they have evolved a lot. I mean they won like two years ago and also this year they had like a really really strong team, really evolved as a team. And yeah, I would hope that the next year will be as after after that. It's nice to see the growth and the evolution of the team and I think that it still has a lot of potential to go higher and like further and I hope like that this is really really good for the esports in general as well so I hope I hope they can make it all the way.
I mean, I think this year was uh, a lot about learning how to work together as a team, even though you maybe not agree in everything uh, or have the same uh, points of views in the game or all these different kind of things. The year with the team was very was very rough, I would say. We had many uh, different obstacles we had to overcome or figure out together as players and people. And I guess that kind of showed this year on the results we got. And none of us was satisfied with that. So, uh, yeah, that was kind of the year. I am grateful for the two and a half years I played with many different players. I won last year and I kind of lost this year. And I think the contrast between winning it all and losing um, and having results that you are not satisfied with is like a really big learning experience. Any last words? No. Mm -hmm.